Hey, 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 hi guys, how are we? Today's Wednesday the 24th, so we have four groups of five and a four. All right, 24th of March, let's learn with Mike. I'm at an area where, um, where I teach and around the area where I teach, there's heaps of construction. Now check out these huge earth movers. So these, um, these are, are called obviously bulldozers, all right? So bulldozers. Um, and they bulldoze the soil, but check them out. What a now we we call these buckets, remember? So these have got the buckets where the, all the soil goes in, and you've got the mechanical arms. And look how big the tires are. So I reckon the tires coming up to Mike about here. So it's huge. Like the tires are huge, and they have these hydraulic arms. So these hydraulic means um, when the lever is pulled, it's the you can see that silver part. Can you see the silver part there? So the hydraulic sort of pulls in and out um, and it would lift the arm up. And you can see there's lots and lots of hydraulics on the actual, um, on the bulldozer, bulldozer uh, arm that would come up. You've got the smaller wheels um, and you can see that the tread, so the black part there where the mud goes in guys, um, of the tire is called the tread, okay? So the tread of the tire, but these are huge, there's some big ones and we've got an excavator here, but look how big this excavator is. Check it out, look at that, how big the arm is with the buckets there and a huge arm and you've got the hydraulics up there. And can you see how much weight they can actually carry? So it's 2,450 kilograms, 2,450 kilograms. So that is one, like there's 1,000 kilograms in one ton. And I don't think we've spoken about tons before. So that can carry two tons, 2.450 tons of soil. So that is such a strong arm, such a strong excavator. Um, it's just massive. So, and over there you've got, can you see in the distance? Oh, hold on, let's see if I can get that right. All right, so can you, oh, I can't videotape backwards and, but in the distance you've got the, the uh, dump truck. So the trucks actually carry heaps of soil over there from one place to the other. Um, they, they'll they move the soil around the construction site. So over here, uh, the voltage is for the electricity there. There's m heaps more excavators over there. Uh, and there's a huge one here just behind me. Can you see that? Ah, oh, wow, I just love it. So as much as, I, and, and you can see all the soils being moved around. Can you see the big soil piles? and it's being flattened over here. They've got the pipes in the distance. Can you see the pipes in the distance? Okay, where the drainage pipes are going to go. Do you see this yellow and green thing? Hopefully you know what that is. That's a toilet, okay, a mobile toilet because obviously people need to go to the toilet when they're on the construction site. So there's a mobile toilet. Um, and over here you have, these are called shipping, uh, sorry, shipping containers or containers. So I'll just show you over here. All right, so they store things in the containers, all right? And then they also have offices because the people need to sort of, you know, do all the paperwork and the supervisors making sure that everything's done right. So they have portable offices here on site as well. And obviously they have air conditioners, so that way if it gets too hot, they can, you know, stay nice and cool. Um, this is called a generator, guys. See this, this is called a generator. So this generator, it generates electricity. So that way the air conditioner and the lights can go on. Oh, there you go. It actually says diesel generator, all right? So a diesel generator will actually create power um, for power to be inside the um, portable office building. And it's diesel, which is a type of fuel. There you go, lots of late great learning on another, well, I suppose this is like a construction site. Alrighty, enjoy, we'll see you tomorrow. See you guys, bye.